Hey, what's going on guys? This is Jake from the D-Pad Bros. And I'm Adam. Yeah, this is Adam's first video, and since the new Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles movie is getting ready to come out, figured, hey, why don't we play a good Konami game for the Super Nintendo? Yeah, one of the best, actually. Yes, some Turtles in Time. By far my favorite Turtles game. Um, the arcade, the original arcade game is pretty good, but to me, like, this is just on a whole different level. Yes. And it has been probably about a good 15 years since I've played this. <laughs> Alright. And you wanted Leonardo, Leonardo, so... Yeah, Leo is my favorite. Yes, and Michelangelo is my favorite because he's just a, a giant goofball like me. Hey, look, it's Megan Fox. Oh, yes, and I, I skipped the story. <laughs> it's oh, well. whatever. We're at the Big Apple at 3 a.m. We all know what happens. Yes, yes, we do. <laughs> All right, let's get into this. Let's see what, let's see what we can do. Woo! Uh. Get some. So, are you excited for the new movie? Uh, yes and no. I'm excited that there is a new Turtles movie and that it's in live action and that the special effects look bitchin'. But the fact that Michael Bay's name is attached makes me a little nervous. Yes. Well, he's only producing it, which makes me feel a little better. Uh, however, I don't care. You know what you say. Adrian fucking Monk should not be doing the voice of Splinter. <laughs> Splinter is an old Japanese guy, all right? Oh, God damn, I got flattened. Did you see uh, that Raphael's wearing a do-rag? Yes, I did. Um, some versions of the Turtles have had do-rags in the past, so I'm not too upset about that. Um, I honestly, some of the stuff I like, I like the fact that they gave Mikey like a puka shell necklace, giving him that like surfer dude kind of look. Yeah. I, I, I'm excited, but I'm not excited at the same time. April O'Neil shouldn't be that hot, though. Uh, I agree. She should also just not be Megan Fox. Yeah. <laughs> like, nothing against, like, her. Like, she's very attractive, and I'm not saying she's a bad actress. But, like, that's not what April O'Neil looks like. April O'Neil should be freaking Emma Stone. Yes. That, I agree. That would be perfect. 100%. Or, you know, I would even be okay with, um... What's her face? Oh, oh, don't get hit by the electric. Uh... Jennifer Lawrence. I think she would make an okay April. Yeah, yeah, she, I, could, I could see her being April. Anyway. Uh, also, is it me, or would Johnny Knoxville be better at voicing Raphael than he would be at Leonardo? Is he voicing Leonardo? Yes. Are you serious? Yes. Honestly, I think he'd be a better uh, Michelangelo. I think he would too, but I was the more I think about it, the more I think Raphael would be okay as well. Just not Leonardo, like... <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Dude, all I know is I wish Corey Feldman had come back to voice Donatello again. <laughs> that was a Corey, wasn't it? Yeah, oh, it was. so long ago. Is it... You need pizza more yeah, than I do. Yeah. Go ahead and grab it. Yeah, I'm terrible at this game. <laughs> Dude, you wouldn't know how bad I hit this game. Just wait till we get to the sewer surfing level. I'm terrible at that stage. It's alright. Oh, man. I remember running this game from Blockbuster back in the day. <laughs> Dude, speaking of Blockbuster, you know what I just remembered the other day? What? Okay, so you remember Pokemon Snap on the N64? Yes, yes, yes. Dude, Blockbuster used to have the little printer that you could go to, and, uh, like, you could bring in your, like, uh... Oh, I remember your, that! Your Ours had it! I remember that! And you could, like, print out pictures that you had taken in Pokemon Snap and make, like, stickers. It was just like, hey, use our, our glorified Game Boy printer. Yep. <laughs> and I, I'm not, no shame in my game. I actually had the Game Boy printer. Hell yeah! I had the camera. I never had the printer. I had the camera and the printer. That's what's up. God damn it! This thing, Baxter's a bastard. Baxter is a dick. Okay, how about you stay on that side and I'll stay on this side. All right. And then when he floats over here, there we go. Quick, man. I, I'm just, uh, yeah, I'm not even staying in my own philosophy. <laughs> I, 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 I'm, I'm, Take your own advice, Jake. I mean, I'm actually really excited for the movie. Anything could be better than the, the third movie. Oh, dude, Turtles in Time? No! Speaking you know, of Turtles in yeah, Time. Yeah, speaking of Turtles in Time, actually, that tagline for that movie wasn't originally Turtles in Time. It was just Turtles 3. Yeah. Th that movie had no tagline. It was just Turtles 3. I, uh, yeah. I'll tell you what, I, that movie's bad. However, I do like the, the one scene in that movie that I always go back to is the one where all the Japanese dudes have come to the future and they're in the bar doing that dance scene. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, it's like, whoa, oh, 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 I, I can't remember the name of the song, that song's so funny. <laughs> 
And the guy's just like, uh. Yep. The guy's one wearing the lampshade on his head. Yep. Wearing a Hawaiian shirt. <laughs> To me, that scene is similar to the ninja rap scene in Turtles 2. Uh, the only scene I remember ninja, from that go, movie. Go, ninja, go. Freaking, uh... <laughs> Vanilla what, Ice. Vanilla Ice, man. How can I not remember his name when I just named an episode after a song of his the other day? <laughs> ice Ice Baby. Yeah. Uh, let's do two scenes an episode. I, I feel like that, that'll be sufficient. Okay. Two levels? Yeah, two levels of an episode. Or or we could do till we go back, till we jump to a different time zone. That's cool. Was it uh, every three? I th I'm not sure. I think so. Oh, watch out for the sewer. Does that hurt you at all? Or just... Uh, I don't think it hurt you, but, you know. God damn it. Yeah, come on. Yeah! <laughs> there we go. Pizza time! Oh, I remember these little bastards. Have, have you watched any of the new cartoons? Yes, I actually really like the new Turtles cartoon. I haven't given it a shot yet. I, I really enjoyed the the old one back in the day. To me, this new version combines uh, the perfect amount of comedy and uh, action. Mikey's funny like he should be, you know. All the characters are spot on. Do any of them eat marshmallow pizza? Uh, Mikey makes some pretty uh, interesting pizza ch pizza uh, combinations. Dude, at one point, uh, some of the ooze gets on a pizza, and one of the one of like the mutants they fight is a mutant piece of pizza. Oh my god, that's awesome! <laughs> it's actually a really funny that, episode. That's awesome. Whoa. Oh, glitching out. Alright, save that bomb pizza until we get ambushed. Did April just glitch on top of that thing? Uh, no. The, that's the screen that shows up when it's telling you to advance forward. Uh, um, but we are let's, glitching, let's, though. Let's pause for a second. Okay, we're back. Sorry, my computer started downloading something. And, yeah. Technical difficulties. You can take the pizza. I... Oh, damn it. Yep, everything's good. We're good. Yep. No glitching. <laughs> we're too bitching for glitching. Alright. Son of a... But you were saying that the cartoon series is pretty good? Yeah, um... Uh, oh, that's Mecha... Metalhead? Yeah, Metal... Metalhead is his name. But yeah, it's, it's the Mecha Turtle. I was about to call him Mecha Head. He, uh... He actually shows up in the new series as well. Does he? I actually have his toy. That's legit. Yeah. Uh, his um, original toy from back in the day. I got it at a flea market. In the new cartoon, uh, Donnie creates him. And he just goes bad? Well, not really. Well, he, he malfunctions at first, but then Donnie ends up fixing him, and so he ends up being like an ally. Oh, I'm about to die. It's alright. You got him. Eat shit, metalhead. You're holding on. Oh, oh I just you died. just barely almost made it. There we go. How many lives do you get? Uh you you're at one, I'm at two. Okay. But it gives you unlimited continues, right? I believe so, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alley Cat Blues is done. Woo! Alright, I think this is where we're gonna warp. Are we gonna warp here? Uh maybe. Nope, we got sewer surfing, okay. Cool. And we got something that looks like from the movie Alien. It, yeah, it pretty much is just an alien ripoff. Alright, now, I don't know if you remember this level or not, but it's literally oh, yeah. sewer surfing. Literally, you're just beating shit up and... Well, it's probably just easier just to not hit anything and just ride it out. Yeah, um, that's going to get harder as the level goes on. There's going to be like a bunch of spikes and shit that we're going to have to dodge. Oh, jeez. Now, what, what's the... Maybe this is just me being stupid and I don't remember, or it has no meaning at all. What are the different colors of Foot Clan members? I don't remember they're purple in the cartoon series. I think they just did this for the game so that you could, like, differentiate between, like, okay, this guy's gonna be harder than, you know... The, like, I think the, the purple guys are the standard ones, and then I think... Uh, like, the orange ones are harder, and, you know... Well, what I'm noticing is the blue ones have swords, like... Yeah, Leonardo. I think... I think there are some weapon-specific ones. 
Ow! Yeah, see, this is the spikes I was telling you about. This sucks. And that's... Is that better bad guys? Uh, they, they are some of the bad guys. Uh, uh, Rat King is actually the big bad guy at the end of the stage. I don't know if you remember Rat King. Yeah, I remember Rat King. <laughs> but, uh, talking about the cartoons earlier, I actually like all three versions of the Turtles cartoon. Um, the only Turtles TV show I'm not really crazy about is, uh, The Next Mutation. I don't believe I've seen that one. Uh, it's the live-action one that came out on Fox. Oh, I, okay, I, I do remember that with, one. With Venus de Milo, the chick turtle. I don't remember there being a chick turtle. There was, and she had, like, a light blue headband that was, like, a that had, like, a braid. Breakpoint. Breakpoint? <laughs> Point Keanu, break. Keanu Reeves <laughs> gonna show up and be like, Oh, dude, what's going on? can't kill Patrick Swayze. Oh, shell shock. Die, Rat King. Yeah, he's done. Oh, yeah. What? Hello? This game really isn't that bad. Yeah. I remember being a lot harder as a kid. Uh, you probably played by yourself as a kid, or I, I don't know, but it's... Oh, it's thanks, thanks, thanks for saying I didn't have any friends, asshole. <laughs> That's not what I meant. No, no, I, 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 I don't think I did. Uh, I did have friends, but I think I played a lot by myself. Yeah, it's it's a lot harder by yourself than it is... Um, is that Razar? That, I'm telling you, I think Razar is in this. Because the second movie was out by this time, wasn't it? Yeah. Okay, so they were like, because oh. Because they, na they gave Turtles 3 the byline, Turtles in Time, because of the success of this game. God, I remember as a kid, I was really hoping to, uh, Bebop and Rocksteady would be in the second movie. That would have been awesome. But they're like, no, nah, we're just gonna have Toka and Razzle. I'm telling you, Bebop and Rocksteady need to show up in a movie. Yeah, like, I was hoping if, Krang if, would show up somewhere. If this movie's good enough to get a sequel, I want Bebop and Rocksteady to be I in the sequel. I want freaking Krang, man! I just want Krang! Krang was my favorite <laughs> bad guy. I was like, oh yeah, Krang! He, he'll show up and be like, hey, what's up? I'm a little head inside this big monster. You want to call it an episode after this uh, stage? Yeah, yeah, we'll call it an episode after this stage. Alright. Woo! Ooh, Mausers! Oh man, I love the music in this game. It's so good. It's so infectious. I might have to download the soundtrack to it. Hell yeah. Uh, I feel a sneeze coming on. Uh. Nope, not happening. Okay. There. Uh, you need it. Yeah. There's some ooze. Mr. Tom the You just got an extra life. Ooh, I did. I guess it's whenever you get a certain amount of points, maybe? Wait till we get... Yeah, here we go. Get that bomb pizza. There you go. Woo! Oh, pretty cool. I'm gonna wreck it! Okay. Why, why is Shredder showing up in the Technodrome? That, that doesn't sound right. Well, uh, I mean, didn't him and Krang team up for a while there? Maybe? Because I feel like in the original cartoon, Shredder and Krang, like, were buddies. I feel like maybe Shredder worked for Krang at one point? Or, I don't know if they, if it was... Toka, yeah. Yeah, and, and Razar. <laughs> Daddy! <laughs> that scene where they first show up <laughs> yeah, in the second Turtles movie. Daddy! <laughs> <laughs> He's just like, ain't you, Daddy? <laughs> I'm about to die. Yep. Okay. Shell shock. Nope, nope. I got an extra life. Oh, nice! I don't know how it is. Hey, man. Don't look a gift horse in the mouth. There, he's dead. Suck it! Can I pick him up? Oh, no, no, no. That hurts. Um, yeah, let's go in. Uh, Hold on. Well, we got a cut, cut scene. scene. Yeah. Nope. Oh, elevator sequence. Oh, yeah, we'll keep going. Leave that beach till we need it, I guess. Yeah. Come on. Let's do it. Yeah. Eat some. Eat it. Yeah. This game's so satisfying. It really is. 
I think I downloaded it when it came out on Xbox Live Marketplace, but... Oh, dude, the re the remake is so bad, though. Like, they changed the music, uh... Yeah, because it was an HD remake. But... Yeah. And it's just, it's not as fun. Now, your favorite turtle is Leo? Um... Actually, my favorite turtle to play as is Leo. Leo. My favorite turtle, like, period, is Raph. I feel like a lot of people's favorites rap. It's it's usually rap or like. Yeah, I have a friend who likes Donatello, and I that, I, I like Donatello's nerdiness. Yeah, I, I find that pretty cool. But other than that, I mean, I feel like I can relate to Michelangelo more than I can relate <laughs> to anybody. Uh, I guess we didn't need that pizza. Yeah, we wasted. Oh well, we will be all right. Oh. <laughs> Tonight I dine on turtle soup. Oh, glitch. There, there's a lot going on on the screen. Yeah. I remember, uh... There's a... You ever play Mega Man X? Yeah. There's a stage, uh... Armor Armadillo stage in Mega Man X. And there's this part where you're on a minecart thing. And you're flying through the end section. And... There's so many enemies on the screen at the same time as you that the game just it can't handle it, so it starts lagging naturally. It's so bizarre. I know a lot of Mario games will do that. So uh, it, if you got so much on the screen at one time, it just for whatever reason the game can't handle it, which that's fine. You know, you don't expect too much for games back then. Right. Two hits to get rid of a bar. I think. Something like that. Something on Facebook just happened. I got invited to an event that I don't really care about, but cool. Alright. Oh no! This is really cool. I, I like the perspective. Mm -hmm. Having Shredder in front of you is kind of. Interesting. It's disorienting, but it, it 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 feels right because the stage is uh Also isn't this the mode seven working? Cause Shredder is actually like in front of us. Yeah, you got another life by the way. Oh nice, I did. Uh I, I think it is the mode seven. I could be wrong on that. There Sorry, we go. Somebody would surely correct me in the comments if we're wrong. But mode seven's more uh when uh, Final Fantasy, when you're moving and the background's moving and it kind of gives you a disorientation feel. Gotcha. That that's more mode seven working. And is this one more traveling in time? Yes, it is. All right. So do you want to call this an episode then? Yeah. Um. Be sure to uh, be yeah. Yeah. Go ahead and uh, watch the next episode.